Hey, my name is Matt Craig, head of the women's basketball coach at Warner Pacific University, and this is Full Court Pressure, and we have a special guest today, softball player number four, Sarah Stanfield, which is a lot different than Sarah Standstill, who probably wouldn't be a very good softball player. So, Sarah, we're happy to have you today. Um, I don't know if you've seen any of these episodes, but we're just going to ask you a few questions, get to know you, find out about you and your softball team, okay? Sounds good. All right, let's get going. Hey, I want to just start off by kind of asking you, what, what was your path to get to Warner Pacific? And just kind of give a little insight into who you are. Okay, so I graduated from Reynolds High School, which is in the Portland metro area. And then after that, I went to Mount Hood Community College and played softball there for the two years. And then at, during my sophomore year, Coach Nathan, our softball coach, was reaching out to me. And then I decided to come to Warner and just stay in the area. And I really liked the campus and how small it was. So I came to Warner. Now let's back up to your Mount Hood days. You were a recipient of a very prestigious award, right? <laughs> yeah. Tell me about that. Um, so I got the most stolen bases in our whole conference. Well, not even, yeah, our entire league, the NWAC league. So I got the Golden Shoe Award, which is literally a golden shoe on a trophy stand. <laughs> nice. Hey, that's awesome, man. Any acc accolades are good accolades, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, and then, so then you guys played a little bit this year, right? This is our first year of softball and you were one of the, one of the first members and you were able to play in the fall and then a little bit in, in the, in the spring, winter, spring, you know, but it got canceled. So tell me, were you on track to uh, get that award in our conference? Were you stealing bases? Were you getting crazy out there or what? Yeah, I stole, I can't remember how many bases, but I definitely was stealing bases. Um, it's definitely a different, like, competitive nature, though, going into from community college to a higher level. But, yeah, our team was looking good overall, and I'm really excited for this year. We look really good this year so far. That's great. I, I love watching softball. Um, it was just too cold for me when in a – to go out and watch you guys. You oh, know, yeah. Oh, my God. Well, yeah, you got some cold weather. It was crazy. Yeah, it was freezing during some of the games. <laughs> the grass yeah, but, in the outfield was, like, crunchy. Yeah. I was like, oh, my gosh. But it's great, though, to listen to you guys in the dugout. I love all the cheers that you guys do. And we're going to ask you to do one a little bit later for us. I just on your – I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that to you. So, all right. So let me ask you a couple questions. What What is your go-to on social media right now? Um, definitely Twitter. I think Twitter is hilarious. So just, that's kind of like my news. That's so bad to say, but I don't have cables. Like that's my news story. Do you, do you post very much on Twitter? I don't post a lot. I retweet a lot of funny stuff. I, I think it's funny, but. Right. Well, that's all that matters, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So when you aren't at school, you're playing softball, what are you doing? Um, working or I hang out with my roommates a lot like we like to hang out we play they're gonna kill me for saying this but we play clue the game oh. clue a lot. <laughs> wow that's or, a 70s yeah. game yeah or like last year like our softball team would hang out a lot but this year it's kind of different with everything going on uh, so. yeah it certainly is well so where do you where do you work i work at uh black rock it's a coffee bar yeah, yeah my son works at black rock oh okay. really yeah in uh in clackamas on sunnyside Oh, okay. I work at the Troutdale one. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Man, yeah, I love it. Awesome. Hey, my go-to, triple iced marshmallow latte. Oh. Uh, they, hey, tell me about you. Get some of that, boy. You're going. So, <laughs> <laughs> so what, what are you watching on Netflix these days? Anything? I just finished binge-watching Vampire Diaries. Okay. There's uh, eight seasons and like 20-something episodes, and I watched it in like a month. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> So what have you I moved on it. to? Have you moved on to something new? Um, yeah, I just started rewatching Keeping Up with the Kardashians. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah, I we'll think it's move, hilarious. <laughs> yeah, we'll move on from there. Um, <laughs> so what is your major and what are you planning to do with that major? So my major is business administration with a minor in human resources and I think that I've kind of like solidified. I want to, after I graduate, get my real estate license and go into real estate. I really enjoy things like that. So that's what I plan on doing. Yeah, right on. That's awesome. Yeah. And right now is the time to be in it. 
Mm-hmm. Well, you can make some money right now. Yeah. <laughs> and that's all you're thinking, right? Where is yes. it? <laughs> yeah. So, um, you know, spring got, spring got canceled for you guys, you know, and it's really weird as an athlete to just kind of have it stop, right? To have your season just kind of pulled from you. How did you handle that? Right. And then what are your expectations going into, going into this season? Um, it was really weird. Like, it was kind of like what, like, we didn't know like answers to like anything. I mean, nobody does. And so that was like the most difficult part is we work so hard in the off season and then just kind of stop, like not even halfway through our season, that kind of sucked because we put a lot of work into it and then it didn't really like get to show all the way through. Um, So for this season, I definitely think, especially as returners are coming back, like hungry and like wanting to like get after it and make a name for Warner and softball. Yeah, that's awesome. And, and uh, this being your senior season, that's, that's a, big time right now right yeah. I mean, are you giving any advice to underclassmen have you have you guys had enough contact with each other to do that um definitely so our last season's team was really close so we definitely all kept in contact over the summer and um the younger classmen definitely know to ask us like if they have any questions about like school softball like life in general um the new transfers and freshmen we haven't had enough team bonding yet to really be like that, but I'm really excited because they all seem super fun, great athletes. Yeah, that's awesome, man. We're looking forward to watching you guys on warm days. Let's hope that happens, right? <laughs> Come out and watch and eat some sunflower seeds. So before we go, you guys have like a little quick cheer where you say a couple of words, clap three times, anything like that? Um, you gotta have something because you guys have a whole library. Of- I know, we have a lot of cheers. Oh gosh, <laughs> I wasn't. I know, I know, I put you on the spot. Okay, okay. Let me think. Um, oh, my gosh. You like, so if, if I were to steal a base, they would say something like, how fast, too fast, how fast, too fast for you. <laughs> See? And how many claps you get in there? Three claps, anything? Probably just like... <laughs> I have no rhythm, so I'm the one in the dugout. If you hear me, I'm like this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, hey, Sarah, thanks for being on with us today. Um, you know, we're looking forward to watching you play and watching you steal bases, and it's going to be an exciting season for Warner Pacific women's softball. Everybody, this is Sarah Stanfield. Come out, watch some softball this year. It's going to be awesome. We're excited about it, and we look forward to uh, hearing more from softball. All right. Thanks, Sarah. Thank you. Okay. Take care.